everybody welcome to, back to kilo sports cards box breaks i have another box opening for you tonight and it is the collectible card club pokemon box so i uh, usually pull quite a bit of cool stuff out of these pokemon boxes um if you like pokemon you definitely should check them out um this you know for only getting like one or two packs out of each uh product uh i always pull quite a bit of nice stuff so um anyway they always throw uh either a um promo card in or some kind of a uh guarantee hit for you so there we go our mark pico is our um promo card Let's go ahead and see what packs we got this time. And the price point is not too bad for what you get. I can't remember off the top of my head how much it is. I believe it's less than $100, so I think it's like $85 or something like that. But for um, the amount of packs you get, I think it's pretty valuable. I mean, I think the value is there. So let's go ahead and see what we got for packs. Okay, so this one I have not opened before, so this must be one of the newer releases cosmic eclipse and then we have fusion strike um evolving skies so i'm not gonna go in order by year i'm just gonna go like kind of what my favorites are uh, vivid voltage uh, we have a chilling rain uh shining fates so as you can see they throw in pretty much all the, the nice packs we have a celebrations another vivid voltage uh, battle styles another chilling rain there's a fusion strike oh there's fusion strike vivid voltage battle styles and it you don't get too many battle styles which is nice because those are always uh i mean those aren't the most desirable packs for some reason i've pulled some pretty decent stuff out of them but i'm not too sure why people don't like them too much uh chilling rain and then darkness ablaze all right so uh, we'll do celebrations first because I have opened a lot of that. Uh, and then battle styles. And then we'll do vivid voltage, fusion strike, uh, darkness ablaze, chilling rain, bobbing skies, shining fates. And we'll leave this new one for last just because I have not opened it before. So, all right, let's see what we can get. So, starting with celebrations. These are always hard to open because there's not as many cards in there. Alright, so we have, and here's the code cards. I do, um, if you want to pause it on the code cards, I do let you have those. Okay, we have Xerneas, Dialga, Zekrom, and Lunala. So nothing too amazing. Not sure if I need any for the for the set there, so I am putting the set together, so um, keep those kind of separate there. All right, we have battle styles, first pack of battle styles. And I don't like to look at the color of the code card because that kind of gives it away, which we all know um, there's sword and shield code for you. All right, so we have our commons. We have a base hollow foil. I mean, a common hollow foil or reverse hollow foil, if I could talk right, of Ponyard. And then we have a hollow foil uh, rare of Steelix. And then, of course, our energies and then our uncommons. Alright, so I try to keep the products together because I, like I said, I'm putting them all in sets and I had them all mixed up the last, when I, I first went through them all and it took me a long time to get them sorted. So, alright, there you go. Okay, here's our comments. We have a reverse hollow uncommon of Weepin', Weepin' Bell. And then our rare is Conkledur. 
Another energy, and then our uncommons. All right, so nothing amazing yet. Vivid Voltage. So I get this box, and then I also get the Poke Pack. So um, check out those other videos if you are into Pokemon cards. I pulled some really nice stuff out of the Poke Packs too. Commons. Uh, we have a hollow foil or a verse hollow Kakuna. We have a hollow rare of Z Chrom. That's our energy. And then our uncommons. Let's see, I'm going to actually put the hollows. Hollow rares, I mean. Always to look them up just in case because you never know when they're going to be worth more than you think. Where did I put that other one? There it is. Yeah, I've actually sold a couple of them for 10 bucks or something like that. 10 bucks or more. So, it all depends on if somebody needs it for their set or not. Alright, another vivid voltage. Oh, there's Evie. He's my favorite. Okay, there's your code. Commons. Uh, we have a reverse hollow Charmeleon. And then our rare is Terrakian. And then we have, and typically I pull some full art by now, but I haven't pulled any. All right, we have Vivid Voltage. Maybe. Oh, I think we got one here. Okay, there you go. We have a reverse hollow clue fairy. And then our oh, we got a rainbow colossal V Max. All right, well, I will quit complaining. A rainbow colossal V Max. That's pretty nice. And then our uncommons. All right, let's definitely put that on the stand. Fusion Strike. Oops. All right, come here. There you go. Okay, reverse Hollow Rare of Toxtricity. Another rare of Galarian Cursola. And our uncommons. Alright, and if you are enjoying the video, um, just a reminder to smash that like button and subscribe if you're not a subscriber. Definitely helps the channel out and I can open more, uh, I can bring more videos to you. Alright, we have Fusion Strike. And you can see me pull more uh, fire. Hollow Snom, a rare Absol, okay, Darkness Ablaze, okay, it's in the front this time, oh, sorry for a second, my eyes itching. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
and commons. And we have a reverse hollow of common squovet. Our rare is vanillux. And our uncommons. Alright, so, well, if that's the only card we pull, at least it's a nice rainbow D Max. Um, chilling Rain is next. That card kind of shredded. But usually in these boxes, I have the whole stage full already. So it's a little slow this time for some reason. There's a reverse hollow rare of Doug Trio. We have a rare Saws book. Uncommons. Uh, the other Chilling Rain. We have a reverse hollow rare of Galarian Slow King. We have a hollow rare of Galarian Renerigis. I know I'm butchering a lot of these names. I'm just not uh, not too sure how to pronounce a lot of them. I don't hear a lot. I mean, I guess I watch a lot a lot of videos, but I don't know if I always go through what they're actually how they're pronounced. Okay, this is uh, the other Chilling Rain pack. There we go. So I do have a whole box of Chilling Rain that I'll be breaking pretty soon. It's a retail box, I think, but it's still... Uh, Clobopus is our reverse holo common. And then we have the rare holo of Tapu Fini. Really slow on full arts this go around. Uh, three more packs and only one full art. Uh, evolving skies. Well, hopefully that one is enough to uh, take the place of all of them. We would usually get. There we go. Here we have a hippo hippodon. A reverse hollow. Our rare is Pinsir. And our uncommons. Wow, really slow. Um, Shining Fates. There's a oh, what is this called? I forget what this one's called. I don't want to say secret. It's not a secret rare. Mm, I can't think of the name. If you know the name which I'm pretty sure you do um, please let me know because I cannot think of it off the top of my head right now of what that rarity is called but it's uh, kind of rainbowish okay so there's one more nice one for a stand uh, we have a rare Zarud Zarude and uncommons Alright, last pack, Cosmic Eclipse. So I haven't seen this one yet. Here's a Pikachu. There we go. Okay. 
here. Reverse Hollow Rare is Raichu. It's pretty cool. And we have another rare of Glalie. And then our uncommons. Alright, so that is it. Let's go ahead and do a recap. Put this one over here. Okay, so our recap's kind of short this time. So all we got was these two, which I guess I shouldn't say all we got because they might be pretty decent. This one might be anyway, the rainbow. So we have a Colossal VMAX rainbow, and then we have this Ky Kyogre, and I can't remember the name of this parallel, but or this rarity, but um, I know it's a pretty decent one. So uh, there you have it. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody, and I will see you on the next one. I hope you have a good night. Bye.